What is up everybody? Just dropped Halloween brand new pictures. We're gonna take a look at them. Enjoy. All right, so first up we have Lori Strode being attacked by Michael Myers. If you notice on the door, you see padlocks, you see all type of security measurements. Laurie Strode has been waiting for this moment for decades, uh, for 40 years it seems. Um, and in reflection, you can see, and I'm gonna enhance it right here, you can see Michael Myers kinda has a big head. This looks like it's fake in so many ways. It's kinda bad photoshopping. Um, kinda makes Michael Myers look like he has a big head. Although he kind of doesn't need a big head because he's the head honcho of Halloween uh, in horror movies. Um, up next, we have a look at Michael Myers standing in the closet looking ominous and scary and creepy like he always does. Up next is a really cool photo, and I'm not quite sure if this is during the movie or just, you know, while they were just hanging around on the set. Uh, older Michael Myers in the mask, broad daylight. He looks cr creepy, but he looks like he's hunched over in ways like he's kind of like, you know, like, I'm too old for this shit. Uh, <laughs> that's what he kind of looks like. And up next, we have a picture of uh, Jamie Lee Curtis and the director kind of just in conversation, just enjoying themselves, you know, uh, I'm assuming before filming a scene or after filming. Um, as well as there was some interesting stuff in the article and I'll run through that really quickly produced by Jason Blum Halloween bring back Lori and Michael to pop culture's current fascination with true crime a British documentary crew comes to the States to visit Michael in prison for a retrospect of the maniacs night of terror Someone has to bring modern audience into a 40-year-old movie. I don't really believe that. I mean, Michael Myers is still well-known. But anyway, uh, their project becomes way more interesting when Myers escapes custody, retrieves his signature mask, and seeks revenge on Lori, with others naturally becoming part of the impressive career body count along the way the whole british documentary crew makes me think some of this is going to be maybe found footage in there a little bit um also stating in the decades following the fateful halloween night forever altered the former babysitter's life now we're being very honest and truthful about that how it would affect the upbringing of her daughter who has a lot of conflicts because her mother's obsession with this incident and her granddaughter who's trying to connect with Lori Green says. Uh, there's also talking in an article about the two uh, people who are playing Michael Myers and a few other tidbits. It's not really, really interesting, but if you want to check out the article, it's down in the uh, description box. I'll, I'll have it right there. Anyway, the trailer drops this Friday. Come back here. We're gonna do a trailer talk and you know talk all over, uh, give our thoughts about the trailer, talk with you guys later in the week. Friday, check back. What are your thoughts about the photos that were released today? What was your favorite? And uh, be cool if you like the video. You know it'd be cool. Give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you enjoy horror because we talk horror on here quite often. So. That's been it. Zombie Chris is heading out. Love you guys. Peace. Good night. Adios.